Good morning. Here are our top stories to kickstart your Thursday, December 28th. A seedy part of the internet unknown to many, the dark web offers a wide range of merchandise that is mostly illegal. Read more here Mr. Justin Yeo Jun XI, 22, a sophomore at the University of California, Berkeley, was on holiday with his parents and younger sister, who had flown over to visit him and other relatives living in the U.S. Read more here The Ministry of Social and Family Development, MSF, laid out its policy on adoption when it commented on a court decision on a gay Singaporean doctor's bid to adopt a child he had fathered through surrogacy in the U.S. Read more here They will have to wait till January for the lift to be fixed, as manufacturer Sigma Elevator does not have the spare parts in stock. Read more here What was meant to be a normal evening for shoppers and shopkeepers at Bedok Mall took a frightening turn when a man wielding a pair of scissors caused a scramble for safety. Read more here Many Singaporeans give their all in national service. We have to make sure future generations also support NS the way we do. Read more here International school operators that also offer after-school day care services are becoming increasingly popular with parents wanting their children to pick up English at a young age. Read more here While Mr. Jeffrey Tan looks like a typical grandfather, the 91-year-old's life has been far from ordinary because of his experiences in World War II. Read more here Manchester City surged 15 points clear at the top of the Premier League as Raheem Sterling fired the runaway leaders to a 1-0 win at Newcastle. Read more here Simultaneously famous and obscure, Ma is the woman behind the popular Chinese label Weon, operating her business out of a 100-year-old garden in rural Zhuhai. Read more here.